mean, I think putting that jersey on for the first time and walking into the building is going to establish how we feel for the rest of the group's lifespan. Yeah, I mean, we gotta we gotta set the tone. Yeah, you know, it's not just for gonna forever. Yeah, you got forever. It's not just gonna make you faster putting on the uniform. We have to establish that to wear that uniform, you have to be faster. We just have such a standard of excellence that you feel a responsibility to do your part while you're here. And I don't think anyone on this team has to try to be a leader or to try and give a good example because I think it comes very naturally just from the type of people that we have around us every day. The women's team has great camaraderie, but I think we're elevated by the men in the group as well. It's not like there's two separate teams. It's not the guys' team, the girls' team. It's union. Here we go. Yeah. All right. Kick enough. Union, I mean, it's not like a male or female <laughs> team. It's really just an elite team. I very quickly realized this was going to be a group that not only was going to like elevate me performance-wise, but was also just going to be really fun. Love it or hate it, you got to respect it. We're going to show out. We got to come out the gate hot, and we got to show why we are supported and backed by Nike the way we are. And I'm very excited to see what this group has to offer. This is a group that I think has the potential to win medals on the international stage and consistently perform on that international level. But on top of that, a team that's transparent and leaders in the community that can set a good example for younger generations. Okay, Ray, good. We're really pushing the women hard today. They're flying right now. There you go. At the end of the day, now that we're in this professional atmosphere, we want to carry that culture to our group and associate every point with purpose. Like, if you're on this team, you contribute to the all-in-all -all goal of winning. You're here for a reason to contribute to the dub. Right, both you guys, how do you know your laps? Hold it down. Could you go another lap? How easy are you? Pete does a great job at understanding each athlete needs individually. Pete has given us enough freedom and independence so that when he's not there, we get it done. There's this side of us that they don't ever see and that maybe we'll never let anyone see of, of how driven we actually are and how much we want to win. In a perfect race, I'm, I'm just, my brain's shut off. I'm just, I have absolutely nothing going through my head until that last 400 where it's just strike or the last 200 kill. I think it's awesome to start to build a legacy from scratch and to kind of think that we're shaping that. Maybe in 10 years time, another group of athletes is leaning on those to help guide themselves in their career. Down the track, they'll be even more grateful for what we're setting up here.